Here in this video, I am going to show you a beautiful tool which I am using to filter out the useless emails from my email list. In most of the cases, we try to send the emails but we don't have the surety whether the email has been delivered successfully or not. It may be that the emails are invalid. So of course we are spending the amount but we are not getting any productive result. So what I am using is I, I am just showing you a tool which is just helping me out to filter out all those useless emails from my email list. So the name of the tool is email validation tool which you will be getting on debounce.io. First of all you have to register here if you don't have the account otherwise you can log in from here. I have already an, an account and I am going to log in to, my, uh, to the dashboard. So here is the dashboard. First of all let me show you uh, the single validation. For example I have an email and I wanted to uh, validate that specific email. So you will click on check and here you will get the result that this email ID role is this and syntax error are false and spam trap false and accept all and deliverable true. So these are all details which will be shown here. So that means that you are safe to send, uh, send the email to this specific email ID because this is deliverable means you have the surety that the message which you are going to send is deliverable. So in the same way you can use bulk validation. So in that you have to upload a list uh, that can be .csv or maybe .txt file. So I have an email list. I am going to click over here and I am going to open it up. And first of all let me show you that specific email list. So I have this email list and here are some email IDs and let me upload it. So here is the output and you have to click on start verification. Finally you will get the result and here is the button of download report. So you will have the three options deliverable only, full reports and custom. So first of all I will be uh, downloading full report. So this has been downloaded here. Let me open it up. So here you will get the whole result of the email list. So here we have the email IDs. So all the email IDs are over here and result is those which are invalid. Uh, here you will get the status of them of those and if uh, those if some email IDs are safe to send then uh, here you will get the specific uh, result label right safe to send and here are other things what are the reasons there are some syntax error there are some uh, uh, deliverable and there are some emails which are uh, not valid actually so here here is status code there is role free and domain as well so if you are downloading deliverable only so it means that only those which are useful to you th that email list would be downloaded here yes these are those uh, which are valid one so except this you have also the api option so here what you can do is you can create an api so click on create api so here for example i am writing here api one once you will click on submit you will get the key that you can use into your code so how you will be using uh, this key into your code is like you have to create a real time widget and here you have to mention that specific key 
and actually we have to uh, add a domain so in the e in the api here you have to set course domain so for example i have a domain umarwebs dot online so i have selected that and now if you will create on real time widget then if you are selecting this and here you can also exclude some of the gmail or yahoo mails which you wanted to block right uh, but for now i wanted to keep it as it is so here is list of approved domains so create a widget code so here is this code wherever you will write uh, this specific code for example you have the body tag inside of body tag you can put this script and wherever there will will be email uh, email then that would be validated automatically right set this value true to block free emails like gmail right so here is the public key and again we have some other things as well so for example we have the integration So you have few options. Uh, for example, you have Mailchimp, and uh, you wanted to integrate over there. You can also use it over there to validate your email list. And we have also the JS HTML form. So what does it mean actually? For example, you have a form, and you wanted to validate all the emails. So at that moment, what you have to do is you have to put the code and that actually help you to validate all those email ids which would be uh, which you will be uh, input which you will input into your form here you will be getting that specific code and you have actually some installation notes that how you can use and what are the benefits of this so here is the note that the widget will search for all fields with the attribute type equal to email and name equal to email so and then uh, the, those fields would be validated right so here we have some account options as well means you have more users then you can also uh, manage over here all the users so you have the support ticket if you are facing any issue you can also uh, go uh, go through this support ticket and uh, create a ticket of specific issue and that would be solved immediately one of the best thing they are providing is like chat support for example you are facing any issue you can immediately do the chatting and get the solution of your problem so this is one of the best thing that i have seen uh, over here so what we can do is we can use this uh, specific tool uh, which can help us to validate all those email IDs which we don't uh, want to send.